Hey, what's up? Shadow Freak 18 here, bringing you another tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to install Chancast. Um, Chancast is a Dreamcast emulator, and a lot of people ask for that, especially because of uh, Marvel's Capcom 2. So, alright, let's get started. Um, as always, I'm gonna give you links on the description right there. Where it's just about this video, just click on more. More or in, more info about this video, whatever. Okay, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna give you all the links. Okay, the first thing I'm gonna give you is the Chancast. Okay, and the website from the look like this. Just scroll down a little bit and go right here where it says related links. I'm gonna tell you the Chancast, whatever. Okay, just click on it and then just save it. Okay, um, once you save it, you have to extract it. Once you extract it, it's gonna look like this. Okay. Open it up, it's gonna have all these folders. Okay. Um, I recommend you make a Dreamcast game folder like I did. I just made one and put one in there. And right here, it's gonna say Chancast Alpha 25. Uh, this is the emulator itself. Um, when you open it, it's gonna tell you to do this stuff. Uh, it's gonna tell you to configure, it's gonna be like this. Just push OK or whatever, and it's probably gonna tell you these things. Uh, what you're gonna need to know is to uh, do this: go to Options and go to Configure Drive. You're gonna, ha you might have to change to a uh, different drive. I leave it on E because it works right there on E. Um, go back to Options. They give you big controls. Uh, you could change the the size of the of the thing make a full screen or you can just push alt and enter um gives you these is that okay. and then if you click on start it's gonna just be like this oh whoa wait it's gonna be like this just by itself just like that you yeah um you're gonna need a bios or ice um what's it called yeah bios so this is the link i'm gonna give you uh to save before to download there uh extract it your things are gonna be looking like this DC flash dot bin and DC bios dot bin just get these two and put it inside the your emulator thing right here in the folder from this folder just go in and just get these two just put them in there so I already have them I'm not gonna do it um, another link I'm gonna give you is Damien tool Damien tool just go right here, where it says download on the right hand side. Just click on download and then download it. It might take a while, depends on your computer and your connection. And yeah, uh, once you installed it and did everything, it's gonna be looking like this. Damien tool. Like. And if you look over here, right in your stuff, it's gonna be this one. This red one with the lightning bolt. Okay. Uh, you need Damien tool because it's like if you're putting the game by itself, like um, you're, you're putting the game inside the system. Um, yeah. And the last thing, the last uh, link I'm gonna give you is the ROMs, rombomb.com. It's the ISOs or whatever. Uh, just scroll down and click right here where it says Sega Dreamcast gonna be saying DC downloads uh, here are all the games there's like an alphabetical order just go right here which is M and right here is Marvel's Capcom 2 uh, yeah so a lot of people ask for that um, I tell you right now downloading this game takes a long ass time 
it depends on your connection um, it took me a while and it felt like forever but once you get it it's worth it okay I'll go back to where it's right here in your Damien tool uh, left click uh, click um, and here are all my games Calcom vs SNK uh, Marvel vs Calcom 2 Soul Calibur and Ultimate Fighting Champ I wanted to show you Marvel vs Calcom 2 real quick uh, that and if this comes out it's a good sign because it's telling you that it does work or oh, and that you picked the, the right um, flash drive thingy um, the right configure drive uh, if, it, if, it, if that does come out uh, go right here with this options and go to configure drive and then just switch it until you get the right one and if you're playing Marvel Capcom 2 go to options and go to Capcom hack so it could run full speed without it or run slow and then go to run and start and then this is going to happen you need a good uh, graphics card or it will look shitty and slow and so yeah my graphic card is alright as you can see and there's more to take on too back to the arcade mode configure my keyboard to be second player uh, these are all the characters I um, already bought oh, I forgot to say just go to options and configure controls and you can fix your controllers right there for first player and second player um, so that's pretty much it thanks for watching this tutorial don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you next time.